With an unlimited budget, amazing things are possible. And this outstanding 1956 Ford F-100 is the result of one man's vision, determination, and one hell of a big check. And while it may look like a familiar pickup truck, there isn't a single component anywhere on this truck that hasn't been modified, smoothed, polished, or created from scratch. And today it is a handmade piece of rolling sculpture that merely looks like a 56 Ford. The paint is a subtle two-tone green that will never go out of fashion. In 30 years, this truck will still look as stunning as it does today, which is a tribute to the builder's taste as much as his skill. There are, of course, no ripples or signs of orange peel in the paint, which has been massaged, polished, and buffed to a stunning shine that is distortion-free no matter where you look, even in the door jams and under the hood. And while the bed is still wood like it was originally, it is now made of exotic South African lace wood, stained a wonderful mahogany color, and detailed with stainless steel rub strips. Power comes from a General Motors Performance Parts 454 Big Block V8, cranking out a towering 425 horsepower. Thanks to a set of custom-made valve covers featuring emblems inspired by the original Ford pieces and a trick intake shroud, it looks completely custom. All the wiring and plumbing has been artfully hidden and tucked out of sight, and even things like the welds on the radiator are precise enough to survive close scrutiny. Plenty of engineering went into the build, so it runs and drives as you would expect, with a ferocious wallop of torque and a rumbling idle. If you just have to drive it, you certainly can and without worries about its roadworthiness. More hand-fabricated components live underneath, thanks to a Fat Man Fabrications frame with a Mustang II independent front suspension and rack and pinion steering. Out back, a traditional Ford link holds the Ford 9-inch rear off the ground, and the 370 gears inside give it plenty of bite off the line without making cruising a chore. A built 700R4 four-speed automatic handles gear changes, and the overdrive allows it to loaf along at highway speeds. Airbags at all four corners allow the ride height to be adjusted on the fly without affecting ride quality, and it glides along the pavement like a hovercraft. Disc brakes with cross-drilled rotors have been fitted at all four corners and are visible through the spokes of the custom-made 20-inch Budnick GTX wheels wearing low-profile BF Goodrich tires. Climb inside and you'll easily forget that this was once a pickup truck, as the custom-made green leather interior wraps around you and your passenger. There's not a single production part left inside, and even the 2006 Nissan Altima gauges were custom modified just for this truck. Beautifully stitched seats, door panels, and even floor mats create a unified theme, and you'll note that the paint job details even wrap around the door frames and continue inside the truck. A custom center console with a waterfall effect between the seats was fabricated and houses the shifter and controls for the vintage air AC system. I think you'll agree that calling this art is not an exaggeration. It takes more than cubic dollars to build a vehicle of this caliber. It also takes vision, time, skill, talent, and dedication. People pay millions for art to hang on their walls. Surely this piece of art that stands in your garage is worth it too. For more information on this remarkable machine, call, click, or visit rkmotorcharlotte.com.